welcome back to another video today i'm gonna be going to a jack daniels event with my friends so i'm getting ready and i wanted to try a wet hair look now i don't have the exact tools of what professionals use so i'm just gonna work with what i have and fingers crossed that it works so testing it out because if it does work i'm gonna forget and i need you here for proof so first what i've seen in a lot of videos because i looked at over 10 videos so damp the hair so i'm gonna damp my hair I really hope this works because I do not want to go out with my hair looking sad. And there's going to be a lot of people there and, you know, I want to look presentable. Okay. This is just water. Water in a bottle. I use this for my beauty blender. Okay, so now we do. I'm going to use this leave-in conditioner. Now... They were talking about hair creams and this and that third. I'm gonna use this because it smells so good. And, you know, I'm just gonna use what I know. I have other products, but don't know if they will work as well as this. And I know this will work. And it smells so good. I get a lot of compliments. I tell y'all, I get a lot of compliments whenever I wear this on my hair or put this on my hair. And this is what I saw them do. This is not what I would do with my leave-in conditioner, but this is a different look. So I'm gonna follow it to the T. And my bangs are so annoying. Okay. Stay there. Stay in one place. Leave it up to me to try something the day of an event. I hate myself. Why do I always do this? So, bam. Hair is wet. Now we do the, the gel. This is a locking gel, it's this one. Uh, again, don't know if I'm doing this right, so I mean, we'll find out, we'll find out. The hair stays, don't know what Spider's doing. She found a bag, she's about to tear it up. I'm gonna wet her because I'm busy right now. Okay, I'm not loving how that looks, but I'm trying to go with the flow here. I'm trying to go with the flow. And if you have a diffuser or whatever, you know, the little thing that makes your hair curly, use that. I don't have that. I don't, you know, you guys already know my hair is fine, so I try not to use any products in my hair. So, another way people do this is uh, they get the curly iron thing, and then they do this, and then the wow hair gel or something like that. I don't know, but sounds expensive and I don't have it it's not in the budget right now and I don't know how many times I will do a wet hair look so oh you're starting to like it now it's starting to come to life <laughs> you all see the wetness on camera and then some people grab the hair and they curl it with their finger you know so you know whatever floats your boat there's a star in heaven that we can reach If we should, I will break a free I will break a free You know the worst thing Okay, okay I'm feeling confident about this Kind of <laughs> Okay, then I saw people do oil Which I don't, they didn't say what oil, so we're gonna use almond oil, and this is from Hollywood Beauty. And I would show you the bottle, but it's disgustingly dirty, and I don't. I'm ashamed. I'm not gonna lie. So I don't know what the oil does, to be honest. But ooh, this stuff smells bad. Okay, should have smelled this before I put it in my hair. Okay, this might be a fail and I might smell like really bad, but it's fine. It's fine. Then I'm spraying this. Um, <coughs> oh wow, it has our this shit. This has argan oil. Okay, if I would have just read, if I would have just read. So before you spray any oils, <laughs> check if you have something, your setting spray that, or 
your hairspray, check if it has some oil. That way you don't have to put some smelly oil in your hair. Oh God, please work. Please don't flop on me, man. I need this to work. Obviously, I don't know, but I hope it stays. I'm honestly not in love with it. I'm not even going to lie to you, but it's too late now. I don't like how that smells. <laughs> this will have to be good enough, y'all. I don't know, but <laughs> I'll let y'all know if it lasts or not. Okay, I think I am going to... Straighten my bangs just because I could just see it making me mad later on. So. <laughs> Alright y'all, we made it to the event. Um, packed is an understatement. How do we feel? Good. Okay guys, so right now I'm actually at Tractor Supply. I've never been here before, but I was talking to my neighbor and she said she got her plant from here and it was really big and it was $20. Okay, so I was like, I have to check this out. So this is two things I was looking at, this Perlisle and this indoor potting mix. And this is $5.79. I'm gonna compare prices online, but I might get it. So it's a little bit cheaper here to get this one here. But the cheapest is going to be Walmart. But I'm going to actually get this pearl out. And you guys will see why later. $4.99. Oh my god. I saw this and I was like, hell no. <laughs> they have some more. I guess this is a different brand. Oh, 25% off. I guess if you got that one, it would be better than Dollar Tree. But the rest are up there. They have a good selection. Oh, and some of these are pretty big. $4. Honestly, I feel like I need this. I keep saying I don't, but I feel like I do. I don't know. Oh, they got these plant clips, though. These right here. It's not a lot, but something. Labelers. Oh, $2. Not bad. Soil tester. I wouldn't get a soil tester. You know what? I really would like this little steak thing to see if the soil is moist or not. That's what I want to see. But this is something, though. I like this. This is something. Wish it was cheaper, but it's not bad. I just use whatever I get for my bread, you know, and use that. Oh, they even have food you can grow. So asparagus, garlic, okay, okay, onion, okay, okay. Surprised. And then they have little decor over here. I've never been to a uh, tractor supply, by the way, so I'm just like, oh, let's do a little tour. And then I wanted to show y'all that one right there, where you can maybe put your plants. Y'all see the little stacks? And what is this? Home and gifts. What is this? Patio cooler. This is so fancy. Oh my god. It's so pretty. How cute is this one? Fresh eggs. Huh. I like that. Even have stuff for dogs. I guess they have a little bit of everything. But look at this dog bed. Oh, $14. That's a pretty good size. This is the one that I use on Spider. And I actually got it at TJ Maxx for $15. And it's $26. That's, I got lucky there. Aches and pains. I like vets best too. I like that. Super shrooms. What the heck? Fish oil. I've heard good things about native pet too. Hip and joint. And then this is what I use. This one. This is what I use on the carpet. But she doesn't. She doesn't pee in the in the wall in the house. So all I hear is birds. Do they sell animals here too? They actually have some chickens right back there. But there's people working on the chickens. But they're live chickens over there, guys. Like chicks. Little little chickens. <laughs> Okay, we made it to the garden center. You kind of have to read the signs to find it. We got some stands and pots. Oh, I guess those just came in. I really like this brand. Honestly, when you're first starting, it's overwhelming <laughs> to really know what you want, but uh, I'm not gonna get any of this for now. Let's see what they have. Don't want roses. I don't think I'll ever be ready for roses, to be honest. Oh well, look, they even have mesa jars, $15. They got some um, terracotta pots for $15. So obviously, depending on the size, the, var the price varies. And I think I'm the only one out here. <laughs> uh, 
let's see begonia four dollars i gotta see the plants that i know whether or not i can tell you if it's a good price or not look at these marigolds right here i like these are these more marigolds no that's something else these are cute i wish i would have waited so i would have got something like this and actually nah it's about the same they have this one what is this called alocasia it's alocasia okay i wouldn't know if it's a good price or not who's running real bad y'all hear the water wow i think is this a zz plant it says 14 dollars oh my god y'all i just had the nicest conversation with one of the workers she was so sweet she even gave me her number because she wants to give me one of her monsteras that she's been growing Anyways, guys, this is why I love doing this because you meet so many awesome people. Do y'all hear that rain, y'all? The rain. Houston weatherman. This one is ten dollars. What is this? Phila. What is this? Pilo. Oh my God, no. That baby is struggling. Wax leaf. <laughs> that one looks kind of nice. Oh, is this the port? Portodora alocasia. This alocasia is so cute. I really like the alocasias. I don't know. These damn bird of paradise. I'm pretty sure these are a bird of paradise. Yep, I knew it. That's a bird of paradise right there. These are also on sale. Oh, these are $2. Oh, these are pretty cheap. got these my mom has a lot of these so i'm not even i wish these were on sale these are cute though i think that's pretty much it these are gorgeous though oh my god these these uh alocasia rico shield oh my like y'all see the leaf in the back oh gorgeous it's been a couple of hours later now i'm at aldi's i wanted to come here because i saw a video on instagram of this lady saying that they have some cheap plants on there three dollars whatever whatever and i'm like man i gotta check this shit out so that's what we're gonna do but i don't know why i'm looking at this just want to see the prices 